In my experience, there's several reasons for, for this to happen. One of them being a weld break, that's the blades not being welded properly, joint welded properly. Another is uh, wheel alignment, that's down to basically servicing and repairing the machine. We've got another big one, uh, material movement, which is quite common and one of the biggest causes of, uh, of, of a blade to break is when, you're, um, when you've not clamped the material properly, it makes the blade hit the material and causes a shock load through the blade, uh, causing it possibly to, to break. Another big factor is incorrect speed and feeds. When you're trying to cut, for example, um, stainless steel and you're using a speed and feed of what you would cut at mild steel, would be completely different uh, but just by slowing the blade down and slowing the removal rate of the blade will make a massive difference and a lot of people a lot of operators um, are, are under a huge amount of pressure these days with uh, lead times so what they try and do is they try and run the mild steel speed and feeds uh, cutting stainless steel and that's one of the biggest things at the minute that I'm coming across and we're advising customers that you know that is causing issue and it will reduce blade life and like I say uh, could cause a blade to break.